Brazil is the most influential country in South America. It is a rising economic power in the world. Because of this rapid growth and good performance of the Brazilian economy, Brazilian society was undergoing drastic developments. 67% of its population now lives in developed urban cities. It has a strong infrastructure and is equipped with all the necessities of life from universities, streets, bridges and hospitals. In this video, we will show you the biggest current and future projects in Brazil. But first, don't forget to share the video and subscribe to the channel. Brazil has announced plans to build a massive green hydrogen plant on the northeastern coast of Brazil. She described it as the largest single project to reduce carbon emissions. The project aims to convert solar and wind energy into more than 600 million kilograms of green hydrogen annually. This project will be called Biz1. The project was built on an area of 1,200 acres on a commercial land in Bessem Port. It is dedicated to Biz1, which is expected to be operational by 2025. Innerwind has contracted 3.4 gigawatts of solar and wind power. The Biz-1 plant can expand from the initial power supply to more than 100 gigawatts. The project cost is $5.4 billion. A giant new statue of Christ is being built in southern Brazil. It will rise higher than the famous statue of Christ the Redeemer that overlooks Rio de Janeiro. Construction of the statue began in 2019 in Encantado. The statue's arms and legs were installed in the first week of April. The statue is 43 meters high, including the pedestal. This makes it the third tallest statue of its kind in the world. The length of his open arms is 36 meters. The monument will be equipped with an indoor elevator. The value of the project is about $351,000. The statue is expected to be completed at the end of 2021. Transcontinental Railway will be built across Central South America. The project aims at easy access to lucrative markets abroad. This massive project is known as the Central Corridor between the two oceans. It connects the Brazilian port of Santos on the Atlantic Ocean with the port of Vilo in Peru. It passes through Bolivia along the way. It is estimated that the railway will reduce the shipping time from 67 days to 42 days. It is 3,755 kilometers, 2,333 miles, long. Its cost is estimated at about $10 billion. It will be the largest infrastructure project of the 21st century. The new railway is scheduled to open in 2025. It will be inaugurated on the occasion of the 90th anniversary of Bolivia's independence. Brazil has announced plans to build a massive green hydrogen plant on the northeastern coast of Brazil. She described it as the largest single project to reduce carbon emissions. The project aims to convert solar and wind energy into more than 600 million kilograms of green hydrogen annually. This project will be called Biz1. The project was built on an area of 1,200 acres on a commercial land in Bessem Port. It is dedicated to Biz1, which is expected to be operational by 2025. It is a 565 megawatts natural gas thermal power project under construction in Rio de Janeiro. The Marli Masul power plant will be equipped with gas turbines steam turbines with a total production of 565 megawatts. The project site is located near the Cabinas terminal, which receives natural gas from the Campos semi brine basin. About 200 kilometers north of Rio de Janeiro, the Marli Masul power plant is expected to be the first power plant to use associated gas in Brazil's pre-salt basin to generate electricity. It is expected to generate enough energy to power nearly 2 million homes. The total investment in the project is estimated at 700 million US dollars. Innerwind has contracted 3.4 gigawatts of solar and wind power. The Biz1 plant can expand from the initial power supply to more than 100 gigawatts. The project cost is 5.4 billion dollars. 
Brazil is preparing to launch an offshore wind farm project. It covers an area of 300 square kilometers and contains 52 wind turbines with a capacity of 12 megawatts. In addition to two electrical substations, it is estimated that 3.1 thousand gigawatts will be generated. The project is designed to provide approximately 25% of the country's energy needs. At present, it has 164 wind farms in operation. There are 19 projects under construction and 84 other contract projects, on which work has not yet started. It has an installed capacity to generate 4,450 megawatts of wind energy. Corona Vaccine Dose Lab This factory was built by the Brazilian billionaire Lehman. The plant is ready to produce 30 million doses of vaccine per month, as of the beginning of 2021. The cost of the plant is $18 million. It will be donated to the most important biomedical research and development laboratory in Brazil. In operation as of the beginning of 2021. Brazil is building a giant watchtower in the heart of the Amazon to monitor climate change and its impact on the ecosystem of the sensitive area. It is a project of the National Research Institute of the Amazon in Brazil and the Max Institute. The tower, which will rise 325 meters, more than 1,000 feet, from the ground, will be equipped with high-tech instruments and an observatory to observe the relationships between the forest and the atmosphere. It will collect data on heat, water, carbon gas, wind, cloud formation, carbon uptake and weather patterns. The Amazon rainforest is one of the most delicate ecosystems in the world. It has a strong influence on the release or consumption of carbon into the atmosphere. This tower will help answer countless questions related to global climate change. In recent years, Brazil has cemented its position as a strong and attractive country in general. By achieving a high degree of economic development, it has now turned into the largest economy in the world. Brazil has maintained this economic development, which has produced a highly competitive market, increased social equality, and a stable institutional environment. All these factors make Brazil a safe place for sectors such as oil, natural gas and power generation, as well as the real estate market in particular as an attractive investment option. In your opinion, which of these projects is the best for Brazil? And here we come to the end of the video, do not forget to share the video and subscribe to the channel.